day three at Cheltenham and our first selection was in the 250 in the Ryanair chase and at 12 to 1 I'm going to select Village Vic and it is an each way selection again because it's double figures and that's with 8 8 sports but it's quite general with most betting firms if any arse is going to give Rolls to Riches a race it's going to be Village Vic he's won a couple of decent races at Cheltenham already this season he's been in great form great art and at, like I say at the price I'd rather take my chance with Village Vic to give Rolls to Riches a race and rather take the short price on offer for Rolls to Riches so that's going to be the selection Village Vic at 12 to 1 and it's an each way selection because it's double figures and that's with 8 8 sports but that's general with quite a few betting firms so the second selection day 3 Cheltenham runs in the 3 30 the world hurdle and I don't think you need to be the brightest light on the Christmas tree to know that I'm going to say Fissile Crack you cannot look past Fissile Crack for this race I still think there's a bit more to come from this animal it gets more impressive every time I see it run it's got everything in its locker, stamina, turn of foot, and for that reason, the 65 watt Paddy Power are often throw the horse for the race is massive, and we're going to tip it up and select it. So that's going to be the second selection day three. Cheltenham, Fissile Crack to win the World Hurdle, 65 Paddy Power. So there you two selections day three, Cheltenham, and what we're going to do with them, we're going to bang them in a each way double. Because of conflicting, obviously, odds, the best way you could do it is with Sky Bet at this present time and they offer a no run no bet with this one where all the other selections haven't got that option and it currently plays for the each way double 25 to 1 so that's what we're going to do bang him in an each way double see how we go bang your comments on cheers for listening Baron. <laughs> <laughs>